When I say bananas, you say peppers. And today we are on a very special mission. It's been a long time since I've unboxed a case of these and I'm so excited to jump back into it today. Do y'all remember Smisky? These adorable little glow-in-the-dark guys. <laughs> I feel like Bathroom was maybe the last series that we unboxed. Those were honestly some of my favorites. Like there was even a set of three that we ended up getting that were so cute because they were all like holding their nose. <laughs> and Dogman and I, we actually have them like in the little, like literal toilet room, the room where the toilet is. We've got like a little shelf there and we just thought, you know, the Smisky bathroom, perfect bathroom decoration. A couple weeks ago, I actually reached out to the Smisky brand on Instagram because I had to know if this picture I was seeing on Instagram was real or not. It's this picture, okay? And it was a Smisky mummy. And I was like, I've never seen it before. And I see these Smisky figures a lot, um, particularly when we're in Austin. We go to two stores that carry that Monkey See Monkey Do and Toy Joy. We love going there. They've got tons of Smiskies. Never in my life, IRL, did I see a Smisky mummy. And they actually messaged me back and said it's part of the Smisky Museum series, y'all. I love art, like art-based figures so much. Um, and so the only caveat is the Smisky mummy is actually the secret figure. So there are six different Smisky figures to collect in this series plus well, hmm. oh, it all makes sense now. I was like literally counting seven. I guess these two little adorable ones are also like coming together. So they're considered one type. So there are six different types plus one secret one. The secret one is the mummy. You guys, we are on a mummy quest. They were so incredibly sweet and sent over this case. So I think we have 12 of them to unbox today, um, but obviously we are going to get some repeats if we don't get the secret or just because there's six kinds and we've got 12 boxes. But they also sent over this adorable little Smisky tote bag. Uh, but I'm going to save the figures that they sent in here for my daily Snapchat ASMR unboxings. They sent um, four like this, two of each kinds. One is called Smisky Work and the other one is called Smisky Dressing. So if you don't follow me on my daily Snapchat, be sure and follow me there. I do a lot of, generally I have one up a day where it's just like a nice relaxing like ASMR unboxing style video. They also have a Smisky Bath Bomb. And I guess he puts off like rainbow colored suds. I wonder what this smells like. A pleasing fragrance. And then also in here, I was so excited they sent these as well. These are called zipper bites and they actually like hold on to a zipper you have on a backpack or a bag. How cute. All right, you guys, but we're gonna be opening all of these today because I feel like this is gonna keep us busy enough. So you guys are about to see they're super adorable, but they're also really fun because they glow in the dark. And some of these art pieces I feel like I recognize and some of them I don't. So let's see who are we gonna get first. Oh my gosh! Wait, was he on the top? Okay, Dolly, right? I definitely recognize this now. For whatever reason in the picture, I thought he was like asleep with a ring, like a diamond ring or something on him, but he has the melty clock that he's using as a blanket. How cute. Let me see what he is called. Smisky Dolly. And the piece is called The Persistence of Memory. I like when they give you like a little extra info as well. So here is the chart. Oh my gosh. They show so many cute like little Smiskies. And then 
it's basically like the same information you see on the back of the box, but I thought, hey, maybe y'all would like to see what the little chart looks like. All right, you guys, next box. Give me a mummy. I need a mummy. Have y'all heard of mummy brown paint? I feel like I could make like a whole video sometimes on these like little weird things. I feel like maybe this isn't like secret or rare knowledge anymore. Um, but there used to be a paint that was called mummy brown that I guess they actually made the pigment of the paint by crushing up mummies. Isn't that startling? I don't know. I feel like now anytime I hear mummies, I just think of like this mummy brown paint. Ooh, okay, exciting. I wanted to see what these two little ones look like. I actually don't think I know what art piece this is from, but I love these two. They just look super cute to me. I always love when there's like multiple ones and they're like a little bit smaller. I think that's so cute. Um, also, I hope I don't have corn in my teeth. I was just eating freeze dried corn, one of my favorite snacks. So this is, oh no, I'm not gonna pronounce this correctly at all. Smisky Fujin and Smisky Ragin are featured and respected gods of weather. So they're supposed to be the wind and thunder gods. So the information, I didn't even notice there is more information on this little chart. So he is, Smisky is the camembert, camembert of time in this surreal pose from the persistence of memory. All right, you guys, next one next one um so that's kind of interesting to think about the mummy too is because like is he meant to be a mummy from a painting or just like you would see a mummy in a museum you know what i mean because all the rest of these look like they specifically come from a piece of art a painting like this girl with a pearl earring right hello yes i think that that is what she is gonna be so far, no repeats. So this is, yes, Girl with a Pearl Earring uh, by Vermeer. Smisky is as mysterious as the girl. Is he looking at you? Y'all, there is a Smisky mascot and it is kind of one of my life goals to encounter the Smisky mascot somewhere out and about. I actually think that Toy Joy had an event, might have been 2021, where they had the Smisky mascot show up and I was like, oh my God, I wish I could be there. It is, okay, I actually don't know if this is gonna be like a painter in a painting or if this is just like, you know, a, a painter. See what I'm saying? This one's kind of like the mummy to me. Like, is he just something you would potentially see in a museum or he's like from the art world as an artist? Let's read the info. Smisky, a knight of Santiago, paints his self-portrait. I actually feel like I should see if I can put the painting or the art pieces that these little guys are based off of just in case Y'all don't know because I don't know some of the artworks as well. I feel like I've known about half and half. I've known two and I haven't known two. Pretty good odds. All right, you guys, what's it gonna be? I'm shocked like we haven't gotten a repeat yet. We just did. Okay, we have the dolly one again. Next one. Y'all, I'm ready to like read more about the art pieces, probably my favorite art exhibit that I've ever seen in my life is um, Christo and Jean-Claude. Have y'all ever heard of their art? They like would wrap all kinds of stuff. It was so fascinating. Y'all, the Museum of Modern Art in Austin used to have like an amazing little, they would have like single um, art installations, like in a, a small, what am I trying to say? Like an auxiliary museum they used to have on South Congress. And to me, they always had the best, like coolest modern art installations. And I'm so sad they've been gone for like a really long time now. Um, but that's where we saw the Christo and Jean-Claude exhibit. We got these little guys again. The thunder and wind gods are back. I guess he's thunder and he's 
wind. Sippy sippy though. Oh, look, it's like a smisky cup. Oh. We're missing three, I guess, if you count. The secret, is it a mummy? Are you a mummy in there? Oh, it's another girl with a pearl earring. Smisky with a pearl earring. Next, is it a mummy? Or who else are we missing? Oh yeah, we're missing the one, Um, it's called the source. You guys, I hope we get that one too. So I can just see if you guys think it also looks like a Smisky with a broccoli. It's supposed to be like pouring a jug of water. But oh, we got this one again. Self-portrait Smisky. All right, I forgot to chant. Is it a mummy? Let's see, is it a mummy? Oh, okay, this is the one I was just talking. Okay, from far away, does it even momentarily make you think? Is he, is he holding broccoli? <laughs> or do I just have broccoli on the mind? Uh, so he is the painting where there's like a water jug. Uh, it's called the source quite apparently. I didn't know that. I feel like, I'm kind of like one of those people where sometimes I'll recognize famous pieces of art or paintings, but I don't know the artist. I don't know anything about it. Cause I definitely like, I know that painting, but I don't know that painting. You know what I mean? Uh, so this is Smisky is the source of water, a spring of poetic inspiration from the source. But they also don't say who is the artist of that piece. I don't know. Is it a mummy? Um, you guys, I wonder how rare the mummy must be. He, he must be very, very rare. Oh, it's oh, the broccoli one again. Smisky the source. We only have two left. And I'm like kind of nervous because I think that there's literally two. Okay, no, there's one we're missing and the secret. Oh, you guys. Oh my gosh. Are we gonna get it? Are we gonna get it? I hope we get a mummy. It's not, but it's the last one we're missing. So, oh my God, is the last one gonna be a mummy? Um, I don't know what this one is, but I love it too, because look, there's a little bitty one. He's like got a bowl and he's got grapes. I like the little like shy one with grapes. Doesn't he look like, I've got your grapes. Um, that's what he looks like he's saying to me. So this is, Smisky is inviting you to join him in a drink of wine. Smisky Little is too young to drink, so he eats the grapes. That's so cute. Uh, Bacchus, I'm not saying that right either. Yeah, I love this one. Also, I've been meaning to show you guys like the size difference, like this whole video between like the two little ones and like full size, regular sized Smisky. All right, you guys. <laughs> Last one, last one. Is it a mummy? Can it be a mummy? Are you a mummy? Is it a mummy? Oh, it's not a mummy. We got this one. He's so cute. He's adorable. I do, I, I love the little grapey one, you know? That's it, you guys. That's it. Okay, Um. let me at least read the info about the mummy. It says, is it a person or a stone carving? Find the mystery to solve the mystery. And now I want to know more than ever, if you get Smisky Mummy, do you open up like the sarcophagus and there's a little Smisky Mummy on the inside? Cause that's what it looks like. Like the outside looks like a sarcophagus. The inside's a tiny little mummy, maybe, maybe, I don't know. The original Instagram post I saw, it didn't, like they, they didn't open it or try and open it. I don't know. Um, but you know what's so wild? It's like before I even reached out, I was like trying to Google like Smisky Mummy and there's like no other pictures of this little guy. Like he must be so, so rare because I feel like I can't, uh, now I'm gonna have to type it on Instagram again and say, Smisky Mummy, show me that mummy. This was a super fun unboxing though. Maybe I will like the next time I'm in Austin, I'll just grab a couple more random boxes of these. Cause now you guys, I feel like my thirst for the Smisky Mummy. Um, maybe I've, maybe I've got to find him. That's all 
all for today. Uh, so a huge thank you to Smisky for sending this over for us to unbox together. I feel like this was a ton of fun and it's been a long time since I've unboxed like a full case of anything I feel like. I feel like for a long time now I've just been like opening random mystery boxes. But yeah, this was like super fun to see all of them in the series except for the secret but you guys mummy quest mummy quest let me know if i should try again in the comments down below thank you guys so so much for hanging out today and for watching if you're not already and you'd like to be hit the button down below subscribe become a member of the banana pepper squad today and until i see you guys again which is going to be very very soon stay happy stay healthy stay sassy stay banana peppery i love you guys so so much and i'll see you again very soon bye